week ago, I bought some new Clinique products, the three-step system for the type 3 skin, which is oily combination. I don't personally see myself as having oily skin, but I took this little quiz thing they have on the website, and it told me, I put in my beauty habits and all that, and it told me that's what I was. So I bought it, and I've been really happy with it, so I figured I'd show it to you. Um, I use the Deep Clean Neutrogena wipes to take off my makeup. And so I'm starting with a totally clean face and my contacts are out. So the first thing I'm going to do is I have a towel ready. And the reason I don't use the hand towel is because it has people have wiped their hands on it all day and that just grosses me out. So I'm going to use the Clinique Liquid Facial Soap Oily Skin Formula. And this is the trial size. I've used this for about a week and I really like it. The reason I started a new skincare, totally new system is because I noticed I was breaking out a lot more. And I've noticed that a lot of those have gone away, which is really exciting. So you just get your face wet. Oh, and start with clean hands. If you, because if you're rubbing all over your face with dirty hands, you might as well just put your face in the toilet. Like it doesn't do anything if you have dirty, gross hands. So you take about that much soap and you just rub it all over your face. And then rinse it off. And then I pat dry just a little bit. Just the big drops off and then I let it air dry the rest of the way. One thing that I've noticed is that it's harder to rinse off I should probably use a washcloth but because it, it's hard to rinse off this area, but you just have to kind of make a mess of yourself and your shirt. So I'm going to let this air dry and then I'm going to come back with a toner. I'm going to take step two, clarifying lotion, and it's number three for the skin formula I'm using. And this stuff does not, that soap smells pretty good, but this stuff stinks. I don't know, I don't know what it smells like. I can't put a name to it, but it's not a good smell. I don't like it at all. But, I like what it does to my skin. So just put a little bit on a cotton ball and just rub it all over your face. I avoid the eye area. I have really sensitive eye, under eye circles and lines and all kinds of problems there. So I'll just leave that alone. And then I'm going to let this air dry as well. Third and final step of their process and it is the Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel. And this really is like a gel. I've never had a lotion like it. It, it has a very, kind of like a filmy consistency. I just put a few dots of that on my face. And then we'll rub it in. And then I just take it down on my neck. And once again, I avoid the under eye area. So then lastly, the last thing that I personally do, this I bought, make sure it's rubbed in. This I bought separately. It's the Super Defense Age Defense Eye Cream, broad spectrum, and it has SPF 20. This is a really, really thick eye cream, and so far I really like it. Um, I'm not sure if it's actually made a difference to my under eye circles, because I think that I'm going to have to use it for probably two or three months before I see any difference. But I read on some beauty website, an incredible one, I don't remember which one it was, that your eye cream, when you sleep, it moves up to two inches. So put it kind of far away, right on the bone. Is it the orbital bone? I feel like it's the orbit. I could, I could be wrong, don't listen to me. But on the bone, you can feel it on your eye. And just rub it there because it will move in the night. And I did notice after I stopped putting it right next to my eye that my eyes were better in the morning. Because when it moves, it gets in your eye and it'll irritate, it'll irritate them. And I did notice that that did make an immediate difference in my eyes in the morning. Far with this system, it's been great. It is kind of pricey. But other than that, so it's going to last a while, I can tell. Um, so far, it's so good. Um... 
I'll get back to you if my mind changes or if I start adding a different step in. But so far, and it feels so, my skin feels so smooth after I use it, and it's just really great so far. I'd recommend it.